Pillager School Project, located in Pillager, Minnesota, a town of 469 people about two and a half hours northwest of the Twin Cities, consists of a 64,000 square foot addition as well as a 14,000 square foot remodel project. One of the project goals was to create a facility that would prepare students for new jobs in technology and to help them solve problems in 21st century society, in many cases, problems that don't yet exist. Woodseth Smith Nolting designed the addition to the secondary school to accommodate graduation class sizes of about 60 and enrollment growing about 3% per year. It includes 11 classrooms, a technology lab, two science labs, a band room with practice space, commons area, gymnasium, weight room, the high school offices, and an early childhood and family education multi-purpose room. Uh, the commons area stands out to most of me, um, just the combination of wood um, through the columns and beams, um, the warm colors that we see in the uh, masonry construction, as well as how we flooded the space with natural light. Our, our students are using these booths and tables as they sit by the windows and it's uh, 10 below outside and it's absolutely beautiful inside. The addition of the commons here that we're standing in is going to create opportunities right there because we can house either a banquet style event in here, can also obviously use it as the commons uh, area after tournaments or before games. The Pillager School District made a commitment to having elementary school children practice athletics after school rather than in the evening. The new gymnasium increased the amount of gym space for varsity athletics so that younger students could practice in the existing facilities during the same after school time slot. Well, the gym is going to be beautiful for our kids. Uh, obviously for practice facilities is our number one concern. Approximately 14,000 square feet of the existing school was remodeled to help expand the media center to include additional seating area and two computer labs. It's great and it's, it's good for kids. It's a great learning environment. So we're excited about that. The project involved over 40 staff at WSN, including architects, civil engineers, mechanical and electrical engineers, structural engineers, landscape architects, surveyors, and support personnel. Yeah, it's, it's a beautiful structure, no doubt. 